20 minutes away from where we need to go, uh, South Dakota. Try killing some snow geese. Driving all uh, night, left at two in the morning. Ryan actually wasn't late, um, so you know, we got a, a good start. But uh, we've already seen more snow geese just driving the last hour and a half than we did our last trip, which was a snowstorm and a white field with white decoys just doesn't cut it. So um, it was a real bust. I don't know how we messed that up so bad. But anyway, I think we picked some good weather. We picked some good dates. Um, yeah. Hopefully the next uh, footage you'll see is us shooting some birds or setting up decoys, one or the other. So, are you excited, Ryan? <laughs> It was a successful travel day. Uh, beautiful sunset out here. Day one for us. Made it out here safe, nothing broke down. That's always a, a plus. Um, took us a little over four hours to get set up. You can see, I think we have uh, 700 decoys, something like that, which is a smaller number compared to a lot of the, the bigger outfitters and whatnot, but uh, uh, good enough to trick these birds into uh, coming in. Yep.
it didn't, I was waiting for him to swing over and it just never did. No, I was like, I'm sure you were thinking the same thing. I'm picking the trees so high up. I'm like, let's just see if they do it. The wind's picking up enough. That's how we get our numbers up. And I might, just might have had that on video. Angle that way. Give it up. day in the books came out with a dozen missed some missed some opportunities but uh, all in all not too bad of a day definitely had a lot worse days so um, beats working right Ryan shots are just so misleading. I think they're they're close enough but this wind it's gusting today so I don't know playing playing havoc with our BBs but uh, unfortunately we're not the best shots either uh, half the time and the other half the time we might hit them. 
last morning out here, so hopefully, uh, hopefully a few more birds come. We got motion and sun's coming up. Beautiful day, so. successful uh, 2024 South Dakota snow moose strength conservation hunt and uh, yeah we definitely could have could have been a lot worse we could have had snow and not on a bird for three days like we did last time or two and a half and I think we called it so um, anyway hope uh, hope you guys enjoy this hunt um, it definitely was a lot harder of a hunt to video um, just kind of getting angles and obviously not moving cameras around. You set it and forget it and hope that the birds aren't free. But for the most part, we had to figure it out. Ryan just brought up, I should have had my camera loaded. So you could have seen the whole spread when we were shooting birds, especially the last couple. Um, we had some that come in. We got a little more patient now and uh, waited with this strong wind. We waited for them to come in tight. And we got three out of four. So uh, anyway, enjoy. <laughs> 